Rainbow Dash! Bill and Ben are Tang Engine twins who work at the Sotochonic Playworks south of Brendan. They have two colt ponies that work with them that were small enough to fit inside their cabs, and they of course were snips and snails. The two engines each have four wheels, a tiny chimney and dome, and a small squad cab. Their job was to shun freight cars filled with harvested china clay. It is needed for pottery, paper, paint, and many other different materials and needs. The twins are kept busy with their pony friends, pulling and shunting cars at the clay works on their spur line, and for ships at Brendam Docks. One morning, they arranged some cars for an important shipment to the mainland, and went away for a lunch break. When they returned minutes later, they were shocked to find them that they disappeared without a trace. The twins were very surprised. Snips and Snails then noticed something on the track and quickly examined a small patch of oil. Is that what I think it is? Oh yeah, it's diesel, all right. Gee, that stuff is messier than pudding. Hmm, I love pudding. It's a waddle? That's a Cecil, I think. Remember that I noticed every morning at our sheds? Yeah, cousins nasals press the Cecils. Well, if I remember, you Bill have a cough in your smoke box yesterday, so it's your fault that the Cecils came and took our cars. It's not. It's two. It's not. It's two. Shut up, you morons. Let's go and get our China clan cars back. Here, here. What? what? I don't think that's a good idea, guys. And why not? Because the disease on my magic us away like our freight cars. Eh, uh, that's nothing. He won't magic us. Unless we uh. magic him first. Snails, what are you talking about? Well, it's very simple. That diesel hasn't seen us yet and doesn't know you two are twins. So we'll take off your nameplates and this is where we get to the exciting part. <laughs> Laughing and snickering, the four friends set off to find the diesel. They were looking forward to playing pranks on the engine. Creeping into Wellsworth Yard, they found the diesel resting on a siding with the missing cars. Ben and Snail stayed behind, but Bill and Snips continued on from the other side. When the diesel saw them, he looked down and said, <clears throat> Can I help you? Yes, indeed. Me and Snails want our cars back. Okay, hand them over, oily wheels. I have no idea what you two are talking about. These cars are mine. G 
Get out of here before I bellow smoke at you. Bill and Snips pretended to be frightened and offended. Okay, Oily Bark. If that's the way you're gonna act, you'll be sorry. Eh, the manager at Brand of Docks will hear about this. Oh, what are you two going to do? Shot me to death? Just you wait. Your time will come. They quickly ran back and hid behind the cars on the other side. Then Ben and Snails came forward. Car stealer? Black market weasel! After that, they ran back too. Then Bill and Snips took their place. Soon they took turns teasing and mocking the diesel. Smelly old diesel! Look, I'm here! Now I'm right here! This went on for hours and hours until the diesel had had enough. Stop it! You guys are making me dizzy! Just wait until I... Huh? The twin engines just gazed at him. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Are there two of you? Yes, we're twins. Oh, thank goodness. I should have known it. Just then, Edward, Applejack, and Big Mac came bustling in when they heard the noise. Bill and Ben, why are you and your friends playing in my yard? You boys got some explaining to do. And don't try to lie your way out of trouble because I won't stand for lying. What? We're not playing around. We're just rescuing our cars that were stolen this morning. What do you mean, stolen? Then the colt explained what had happened. Wow, you boys sure had one doggone heck of a morning. Exactly. Even though you and Edward take our cars without telling us first, but that's fine. We know you take them to Brenda for us, but this deceased came the unthinkably. Well, that's understandable, but there's no cause to misbehave. Besides, this diesel you're looking at is a Metropolitan Vickers Diesel Electric Type 2, or better known as the Class 28, the newest diesel from British Railways, and Big Mac happens to be the first equestrian pony to be his engine driver. Yup. The twins and two colts were very impressed. Whoa! Oh, so sweet! We're sorry about the mix-up, Mr. Um... Never mind, Mads. It's all Walter under the bridge now. My name is Boko, by the way. I'm sorry I didn't know these cars are from the China Clayworks. I thought this was an express goods. Well, at least there's no harm done. Right, Big Mac? Yep. I figured those boys would meet Boko sooner or later. That's alright, then. Now off you go, Bill and Ben. You and the Colts go fetch Boko and Big Mac's cars, and you can take the China Clay back to Brandon. There's no real harm in them. They just like to cause mischief, but they can be maddening at some times. Yes, indeed, Edwin. Maddening is the word to describe those lads. Don't you agree, Big Mac? Yup. <laughs> <laughs>